Well, our hat certainly goes off to the city of Boston. It is truly an awe-inspiring sight to see not only how the runners dedicate themselves to the 26.2 miles, but also to the city. Boston becomes electric during the lead up to Patriots Day, but it's a city with a rich and proud history. I spent the week there and had a chance to play tourist at two of my favorite spots. Have a look at my wicked Boston adventure. Well, one of the last stops on the Freedom Trail and probably one of my favorites because of my military background is, of course, the USS Constitution. And to tell me all about it and to give me a little behind the scenes tour is Yeoman Petty Officer Third Class Cody Miller. Uh, I think the first thing that I love about this ship is that she's undefeated, 33 and 0. Absolutely. So, um, so some of the cool things about the ship uh, is, first off, she is Boston's only undefeated team. Uh, and then uh, second off, she was actually built right here in Boston, Massachusetts. Uh, right across the harbor, there's a Coast Guard station. That's actually where the, the, uh, the keel was laid in 1795, later finished in 1797. So I think that kind of gives it like a, a homey touch here. Sure, and, sure. And, so uh, the cool thing here is, is that you can come and you can check it out. You can obviously walk around the decks. You can go below decks. And you're just going to show me some of the cool stuff about the ship, yeah? Absolutely. Let's All go right, on. Let's take a walk. Okay. Well, from one historic American icon to another historic American icon, or at least a uh, historic icon in name. You'll see what I'm talking about next. I'm thirsty. Are you thirsty? Let's do it. You're going to like this. Well, the perfect place to end our wicked Boston adventure is at the Boston Beer Company. They are the makers of Sam Adams and many other fantastic brews. We're going to take you inside, give you a behind the scenes look, and they've also got something special brewed up just for the 26.2 miles of the Boston Marathon. Come check this out. Adam, sir. Nick. Welcome to the Samuel Adams Boston Brewery. Dude, thank you so much for having me. I'm stoked about this. I love this place. Well, first and foremost, let's get you out with it. A little gift from us here from the Samuel All Adams right. family. You guys' relationship here in Boston is pretty incredible. You've been doing this for over 31 years, and you've been doing it in Boston for that long. The beginnings of this place are pretty cool. So it all started with Jim Cook, our brewer and founder. Jim literally brewed up the first batch of Boston lager in his kitchen. You know, fast forward a little bit, we make our very first sale on Patriots Day uh, about, uh, I believe it was 1985. Wow. So we have a deep, deep connection to the marathon and the city, and we're really, really excited to have you here today. Yeah, and of course, Patriots Day is the day that's celebrated in Boston when the marathon is actually run. And to commemorate that, you guys have started brewing something that's pretty awesome. It's called 26.2 and it is just around marathon season. I've been here three years. It is literally something that I look forward to every single year. So I think first and foremost. May I? May you I? may, please, by all means. But tell me about uh, tell me about 26.2. 26.2 is a really special brew. Now, this is a treat from our brewers. We only do it around the marathon, and it's a really old German style called a Gose style. Our brewers use malted wheat, unmalted wheat, coriander, and kosher salt. Um, now, we get to take these on the tour, right? Absolutely. You need one. All right. Well, and, uh, and that brings us to the tour. We're going to check out a little behind the scenes and show you exactly how this place runs and operates. And Adam, you're going to be my man. Cheers. Cheers Let's uh, get this party started, sir. Absolutely. <laughs> So this is it. This is where the magic actually happens. Welcome to the brew deck in the Samuel Adams Brewery. Ooh. So uh, this is where we've brewed every single new style of beer. And you can see it starts right here in the copper kettles. Generally, the brew process, our brewers will start at about 5 in the morning. We'll mill up some malted barley and seep it in that vessel right over there. That's called our mash ton. We're going to soak those grains. And as we do, starches will get converted into sugars. This is called the louder ton. The louder ton helps us get that liquid out. That's what the brewers call work. Okay. And uh, that's what we need for our beer. And then it moves all the way over there. 
Yep, we've got a brew kettle over there. That liquid will boil it for about 90 minutes. And we actually add hops, not one, not two, but actually four different times for Boston Lager. So okay. we do a pound of those Hallertown Middle Fruit hops per barrel. Well, great to have you here, Nick. Cheers. All right. Cheers, my man. Uh, listen, that's going to do it for uh, this edition of Podium 360. Thank you so much for joining us, and thank you so much for coming along on this wicked Boston adventure we have been on, and there is probably no more fitting a place to say goodbye than here. Uh, and, and speaking of which, that's going to be a problem. Nick, we're a brewery. We don't run out. Come with <laughs> I'm going to leave you with our parting shot, and I'm going to go find more of this.